A man accused in Wichita Falls 15th homicide of the year is now facing two additional charges. The new charges are aggravated assault with a deadly weapon and unlawful possession of a firearm. They were filed on 28-year-old Sidney Garcia, who has been in jail since November for the murder of Michael Allen on Welt Street on October 27th. These charges are for the shooting of a second victim who suffered non-life-threatening wounds. Police say he had numerous gunshot wounds to the leg, foot, and behind, and his his femur bone was shattered. The victim told police he and Allen were outside on Welch when a man he knew as Psycho arrived and began shooting at them. He later positively identified the suspect as Garcia from a photo lineup. At the time of this shooting, Garcia had warrants for a shooting at High Point Village Apartments where a man was shot in the foot on August 26th. The victim told police that he and Garcia had been dating the same woman, and the woman called him for help when Garcia began assaulting her. He said he and Garcia agreed to fight outside, and while they were fighting, Garcia's brother gave Garcia a gun, and the victim ran and was shot. A great Nissan sedan associated with Garcia was seen at both shootings. Garcia was arrested on November 3rd here at the Econo Lodge Motel, and his sister and girlfriend were charged with harboring and hindering the arrest of a few. Fugitive. Undercover police say the women, uh, the women were trying to help Garcia escape when all three were arrested. They say Garcia admitted to having and using a firearm at the Welch Street shootings and admitted to being in a fight with a man at High Point Village, but denied firing any shots there.